Okay, this video, I tell you which map I hate the most. Not only the map itself, but the single most agitating part of that map, and I rank that part against all of the other ones. Hanamore, first one on the list to cover. This is the choke point that I hate the most. The very first one on attack. We've all been here, we've all been full held at this choke and been super frustrated. But overall, not something that has wasted away my life completely. I give Hanamura a B. Next up, Hanamura Winter. It's back again, but this time with the same amount of snow on Mount Fuji. What's that about? <laughs> Temple of Anubis. This one doesn't have like an absolutely disgusting choke because the choke's kind of split into two here. It's higher up, you can go into here, you can quickly get away into this room, get away into that room. This choke point, not too bad. C. Volskaya Industries. Zarya's home, Rasha. Here we have the very first choke point of the map. Definitely the worst one. You have to go through here. You have a little window like Hanamura. There's this big truck cover for the defender side, but not as bad as Hanamura. I'll give this one a C as well. I'm giving them all C's. No, I'm changing my mind on some. Hanamura gets upgraded to like an A. Actually, the more, the, since I've looked at the three that are in the map pool, Hanamura is definitely the roughest of these three to start. Both Sky is a B and Nudubis is a C. There you go. Feel better about that. Just because you're not in the game anymore doesn't mean that you're safe. Horizon Lunar Colony, back on the moon, where a lot of you thought you'd never have to return. Here is a good case of a killer choke point. Everybody has to walk through this between these two walls, no matter what. No, this is terrible. This choke point with this high ground presence. But saving grace is that you can go to space. Wow. This doesn't save the choke point and how mad and frustrated it makes me. This is getting an S tier. That one's for you. Bracken. Perry is next on the list. Another one you thought you were rid of. Nope, not in this video. Here is the choke of all chokes, Paris. It is an even more narrow column from Lunar Horizon. Absolutely horrid if you had to play this map. This one easily gets an S. Next up, Dorado, the, our first escort map. There's no like real hard choke point. I'll kind of go over what I think is like kind of the hardest section maybe to crack. I mean, the parts that have given me the most frustration. I would say it's probably this second leg right here. This has been a really tough leg to finish off through here, especially with this high ground dominance. And if you don't take control of this, um, it makes it extra hard to complete. Where does this land in the rage meter? <laughs> I think this is a good beat right up there with the Volskaya level for me. We're in Cuba. Havana. What I dislike the most about this place. For this one, I think the first is pretty hard. It's definitely the, one of the maps I've played the least amount. Is this true for you guys as well? For me in my playtime, I mean, this is true across the board. I don't really complete very many maps. But out of all the escort maps, this feels like the toughest first leg to capture. But overall, I'm going to put it at a C. Welcome to the land down under junker town i like this there's not like one major pain point to me so for me this is a this is a absolute f-bomb <laughs> we're in italy rialto now what i just said about havana how i think it's might be the hardest to get the first checkpoint this is its competitor right here i'm trying to figure out what part is the worst it might be this bridge you get stopped as an attacker Defenders can just kind of like poke at you from here pretty safely and retreat back into a strong position behind corners. While you can't really do anything about it, you just have to walk up and over this bridge. Also, trying to walk up this little hill for the third checkpoint can be pretty rough to get walk up this, especially if they have that. So, where does that put it? I'm gonna give it a B. But look at the boats, those are cool. <laughs> We're in America. <laughs> Route 66. I don't know if this is the point I hate the most, but this is the one that's precious on the mind when I had a rank game. My team flew through to like this point and then well, actually we might have gotten to like here. We were absolutely rolling and we just kept walking all away, all the way around like this on the low ground rather than going on the short way 
reducing the amount of poke we got. Pushing off the soldier from here. Yes, I'm bitter. This place sucks. Just kidding, I like Route 66 actually a lot. It goes D for me. I like Route 66. We made it. Watch Point Gibraltar. I think this is like one, if not the only one that's actually set in like an Overwatch world that's not doesn't have like a real destination from Earth. Anyways, this one also has like a true choke points. Points? Just a choke point. But multiple doors right here. This right after capturing, you have to walk through one of these small doorways. And if you hold this, you get to see all four and you can be suppressive as crap. <laughs> Super hard to crack. I'm going to give it an A. Blizzard World. I guess this is another one where it's set in a Blizzard universe or Overwatch universe. I don't know. Is it marked with the Overwatch logo or does it have a country? I should have checked when I loaded it in. Nobody cares now. Blizzard World. This. Oh, you get held so much here in my low evil. <laughs> it's tough. This is an instant like A just for this point alone. It's so hard to cap this one. Eichenwald. Germany, home of for Reinhardt. This one I hate, meaning this point exactly. Man alive, if Havana and Rialto are the hardest to ca finish off the very first objective, Eichenwald is probably the, I don't know, maybe Blizzard World's harder. This one feels more suppressive. This feels like a solid choke, <laughs> but uh, this one comes to mind when I lose hope. <laughs> this is F. Back in America, baby. Hollywood. I guess they, I mean, no, this is where they would use that accent. Acting. The first point, that first choke can be bad? Question mark? <laughs> this is definitely the hardest part is this entirety of this section. If I pointed out Dorado for that high ground domination, there's multiple spots throughout this second leg that can just absolutely dominate and shut you down. Um, so for that, it's pretty strong, pretty tough. Is it going for a B? King's Row, where the famous assassination happened of the robot. This is definitely the tough part. I, th I mean, this whole map can kind of feel slimmed down like all the combat can be, but it's still fun. I think it's a, it forces a lot of closer engagements, especially throughout the first fight and the, unless they hold up there. It's hard, but overall it still is like, an enjoyable map there's a reason why it's a like a community favorite across the board pretty much so this will go i'll make this a d it's so weird to say it. yeah this is good d f <laughs> the last map we are going to review and showcase it's nubani nubani is interesting because there isn't like a hard choke i mean it's through this but you can also go up around to the left over here grab high ground control climb up to the right or jump up there push people off and then you can have high ground presence and like shoot fish in a barrel or me and my teammates that make me go insane walk here and decide we'll be in the fishbowl actually please shoot us and i hate it i always go with the high ground and when my teammates don't i think i'm better than they are <laughs> so this one has definitely got my blood boiling a few times this is an a but the most despised thing in the world is this ginormous hole, S tier. And that concludes the ranking. We aren't gonna touch on all the control maps. It's not that hard of chokes. The hardest choke is when you get spawn camp and that's just demoralizing. But I highlighted what I hate the most is that dumb well, nerf that crap. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye, internet.